All right, we are making quesadillas. Oh, Moses got his, I know it's gonna be enough onions. They're from the garden, fresh. <laughs> Marinated chicken, get out. Oh, do we have fresh tortillas? I have one more from the garden. Yeah. Yeah. This is our marinated chicken. We're gonna cook. We're gonna make quesadillas. This is like might be one of my favorite things to make. It's really really easy. I marinate the chicken with like cumin, chili powder, onion, garlic, olive oil, paprika, salt, pepper, just whatever flavors you like. I had this sitting for a couple hours. So now we gotta chop the vegetables up. Um, green peppers and a little blazing onions. Oh, you can't even see you. <laughs> we'll just show you chopping it. <laughs> that is, yeah, that's cute. <laughs> oh, that looks scary. <laughs> what? It kind of looks scary. Like you're gonna chop your. You look like um, like a tiny Beetlejuice. <laughs> should I get you a chair? Maybe? You should have called that the new dog. Huh? Miko. Miko, tiny Beetlejuice. Oh, I want to show you guys Miko so bad, but I don't know if the... Moses recorded it, but we think the files are corrupted, which is... No, we're uploading. We'll fix it. <laughs> I do have faith in you that. We'll just we export will fix it. files. You said tech support? Export. Uh oh. But yeah, I'm tech support. <laughs> are these fresh in here, I think these are the latest you got. Yeah. You guys, we are. Let me make sure. Where is that inspiration on here? I was just thinking, yeah. We are. <laughs> this camera's just my angle. It's so funny. You remember me of like, <laughs> it's like you don't want to be seen. No, it's like um, I'm a giant. <laughs> I know. Why do you look so tall? We're going bridge gymnastics tomorrow. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This is my dream come true. On so many levels. All right, then I take some canola oil and we put it into the skillet. And this is like super easy. The, the marinating is really easy. The hardest part is chopping up vegetables. Oh, I'm surprised you're not crying. Those are so strong. I'm already feeling it. I'm just looking for the lid. Okay. It is so strong. Holy cow, the honey is really strong. Yeah, for some reason, the fresh ones are just, it's unbelievable. The whole house Ooh. smells from them. Oh, man. Let me get these up a little, too. It's like oddly satisfying. These are huge. Do you think these are, have nutritional value, or do people just like them for the spices? Peppers? They do, yeah. They do have nutritional value? Oh, yeah. I think they also have, I think they have a lot of vitamin C. Really? But they're really good, yeah. Good to know. I'm not sure that onion has. Yeah, the little pie is for the... Like Buddhists won't eat, like they don't eat onion or garlic. Why? I don't know. I think for them it's almost like poison or something. <laughs> Wait, is it bad for you? No, but it's just like spiritually. <laughs> it's like... Really? So how much do we need? It smells good though. It does smell good. Um. Like one more? Yeah, like one more. And like little pieces. Yeah, yeah they'll break down. Tiny pieces. Oh, we just worked out for an hour and a half, which was really exciting. Moses went to go do his tuxedos, and they said, he's like, my shoulders are going to get bigger, and I'm like, okay, we'll come back when... You're ready to get fitted, which is so weird for my dress, the wedding dress, like they can take it in. They're like, we can always just take everything in, which is because I was like, I don't lose weight. They probably hear that all the time. People are like, I don't lose weight. Like, yeah, but I think a dress in a way is more flexible than a tuxedo. Because he said it's mainly the shoulders, like they can't fix that. Or it just would be so expensive, you might as well make a new um, jacket. But it's, uh, it's so funny because I'm so ignorant when it comes to like... I don't know even the difference between tuxedo and a suit. You know what I mean? Like for me, it's like there's a jacket, there's pants. Did you ask him? I don't, I don't 
I mean, I know the difference, but... Because he showed me a tuxedo, and tuxedo has a line in the side of the pants. Oh, yeah. And to me, it looked like so not... I don't know. It didn't look fancy to me. It looked like, what is that line on the side of the pants? You look like a magician. So... So, but it was like, you know, it's kind of... That's like classic like, oh tuxedo. Anyway, that's fine. Wait, do you not want to wear it? I don't have to wear a tuxedo. No, but I can choose not to have the line on the side. But the line is iconic. I mean, you don't have to, but that line is like iconic. I'll see. I'll design it and then know. Okay. I like it, but... But wear whatever you want. <laughs> Obviously. No, All right. Pattern. I'm excited to see it. Won't show them yet. Oh. The pattern's good, yeah. It's very watery. Oh, the pattern is good. Yeah, there's like a flow to it. Mmm, this one's good too. Yeah. Remember when bagels and cream cheese were like <laughs> all their age? You like those, you said. Oh, you're talking about the butter bread and cream cheese. The what? You said bagels. What did I say? You said bagels, but oh. you mean peppers. Oh, that's what I meant, yeah. Yeah. My bad. But I told you, in Israel we do that, like on the regular, on the regular basis. That's it's, so funny. It's like a snack we have over there. A tiny snack. Okay, so now I'm um, putting this over medium heat in the oil. Ooh, the oil was already ready to go, which is good. So I kind of space it out, so it's cooked properly. And then I put a lid over it. Usually like 10 minutes, but when you smell it. That's the best part. It smells so oh, good. It smells so good. Like when the heat is kind of sizzling, that's what it smells like. This is just, I love the spices all together. I would think I would like paprika and stuff, but I love You'll it. like the food in Israel. Huh? Everything has paprika in, in it in Israel. Really? Yeah. It smells delicious. I can't wait to go. Got so many exciting things coming up. Just can't wait for everything. Mmm. Smells good. Okay. So I rinse that off. So I make two quesadillas and then I make like little burritos on the side to eat while it's hot. Because quesadillas take a little time. I'll get the cheese out. Ooh, beach ball and curry and reese that. I'm so excited. Do you do you want them chopped like really small or? Um yeah. Yeah, that's good. I guess whatever you think. Mmm, they are sizzling. I'm so excited. I haven't eaten all day. Well, you haven't. I know. Yeah. <sighs> Yum. We don't watch Girls Next Door. I feel like that's a good one to watch Next Girls Next Door and then go to bed early because we had a late night last night. We saw the dog at midnight. We saw me go at midnight. And then tomorrow we gotta go up early. Yeah, he was. Are you gonna? Are you he ready? He was so cute. Oh, he was so cute. I've never seen a dog be so like adjusted immediately to a mm -hmm. new place and new people. He was just so down to be petted and like playful, playful, climbing on things. Like he was just so cute. You're so good at chopping vegetables. I like. I don't know why I can never do it. I like doing it. I think it's meditative, but I don't. I can't do it. I'm not good at it. It's the arts and crafts part. Yeah, that's the best part. It looks so pretty. Marinated chicken or something. We never did growing up. I don't think my mom has ever marinated chicken. So like, it's a new concept for me and I love it. I'm like, wow. Even to like, we're trying to cook healthier. So I'm like, oh, I'm a grill. I put like lemon pepper seasoning on my chicken or season it the way I would do those wings, but grill it. Like, the possibilities are endless. It's probably oh, enough for two. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. plus the chicken. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, unless you want some more in your little burrito. But no. I want it in a bowl. I'm just going to eat it like that. Okay. 
Well, I might have a little burrito. Yeah, same, just instead of putting it in there. Okay. Um, so maybe a little bit more. Mm -hmm. I didn't know Liz cooked the chicken either. I didn't know that's why people put Liz on things. Like, I didn't know it cooks everything inside. Well, it keeps the heat, like, circulating from the top, too. Oh, I didn't know that. Because otherwise it only gets cooked from whatever touches the, the bottom. Like with eggs, you would do that if you want them to be over hard. Really? If you want the yolk, the yolk, you want it to cook more. Oh. It already smells good. I know, I love the smelling of it. The smell of it, it smells good. All right. I think you look like a diet. Hmm? Maybe I should move it over. No, it's cool. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I like it more like this. You just see your shirt. We can then. No, I mean, they see the cooking rather than... Oh, here. Maybe. Oh, right. They see more of the process. I don't really see you. <laughs> Push it up. I'm too tall. I know. Why do you look so... That's good. Look so huge. So excited to eat. What else? That's it. Once this is done, we'll throw those in for a couple minutes. Thanks, baby. You're good. It's a group effort. Good. It's so sweet. Hi. It's the best part, cooking together. Aww. I know. I feel like even when you're the one doing more of the cooking, I'm here for more support. If I'm the one doing more of the cooking, he's here for more support. Like the big ZD, I'll just, we'll just be waiting for the water to boil and the sauce to cook. I just stand here. Big Z sounds good. I really want Big Z. I've been doing good on my diet. Well, obviously not diet, but... Each of them has, has this part. I'll take it in. It goes all. Well, you do the ricotta. All that I'm selling, like, then when you, like, fried chicken, I do the batter. He puts it into the... I fry it. To the one. You can show your new my Nike clothes. <laughs> Nike, huh? <laughs> Nike, huh? Did you see the new beach plum that we stopped? No, I. I love that. That's my favorite here part. And, and 4 p.m. Mm -hmm. Did you go upstairs for a minute when I was sleeping? Yeah, I came into the room, so you were sleeping. I didn't know how long you were sleeping. So I was like, okay. Did I'll you stay sleep. in the room, or you just looked? No, then I went. I had to do a few things. What'd you have to do? Bring the trash cans from the street. Mm -hmm. Check packages. Um, Banking stuff from my computer. Oh, you know. Now that we are invested in crypto, <laughs> is that what you're talking about? <laughs> are we making baller? Are we Definitely baller making money. <laughs> Yay, crypto king over here! <laughs> <laughs> I just have not with you, but I just feel like. Like something will go wrong with cryptocurrency. Like people are gonna, like the people promoting it are gonna get arrested. For fraud. We watched Wolf of Wall Street on Saturday, so I feel like that's gonna happen again. Like with with people promoting these coins, right now. Like something right seems now. fraudulent. Not like the people buying the coin. I don't know. The whole thing just I just I can't even. No, get it's in happening it. right now. There was this one YouTuber that he's like into tech and stuff, and he made his own coin and convinced people they're gonna get millionaires. They bought it and then it crashed. But he took all the money. So, I mean, people do that right now, but you just have to be smart and not follow like the greed of it. Like if people are like, oh, buy this, you'll be a millionaire. That's not gonna happen. Yeah. But people that bought Bitcoin 10 years ago, yes, you have to. The greed of it all. Exactly. Just don't be greedy. What, the, you know what, greed is like the downfall of everybody. Once you get greedy, I feel like. Well, then your motivation is not the right one. Yeah. I feel like money, I've always said this, money always comes and goes. I'm never worried about money. Like, I'll find a way to make it. I'll find it won't. Money doesn't make you happy. Like, I'll be happy with literally anything. And for and I've always thought that my whole life, but like, I still, like, I, cause you know, with YouTube, one point in YouTube, I got my, my monetization was taken away. Like, I was making $0 for like six months, and I was just like, you know what? I didn't worry about it. Like, you always find something else. 
went on tour, did Patreon, do OF, like whatever. There's always something. So I never like stress about things. So I feel like, I know people are like, oh, it's easy to save me on money. But like, even when I wasn't, like when the monetization was taken away from me, it was like 2017. I was so behind on taxes. They put all my accounts to zero dollars. So I had zero money. I was getting zero income. Like, it was living down my means. Like, it, but I still felt that way. I was still like, it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. And it is. It's always fine. Like, because if you get stressed, it's even worse. You can't focus or be creative. Yeah. And I, and so, yeah. Because up until 2017, like, I was like, definitely not even saving money. And, but it comes and goes. And, Things happen and things come up and I don't know. That Wolf Wall Street movie, ooh, was so good for that. It was like the come up and then the come down. It's like, mm-hmm. Greed. Man, that is. That's good. Yum. Yeah, that looks really good. Good job trying the chicken. This is like. Group effort on the chicken, too. Yum. Take a little longer, right? Or you think it looks good? To me, it looks good. Okay, maybe like Because it's going to cook more with the vegetables, too, right? A little, but... No, no, no. I take this out, and then I put vegetables in. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah that makes sense. It's like two minutes. Wow. Oh, good, good videography there. That's our elephant plan for you. <laughs> and I was mentioning. Show the show the kitchen. I love that I got that for my birthday from Moses because I always saw it when we went to the grocery store and I was like, I really want this. But it like spilled on me one time, the water, and I was like, oh <laughs> forget it. Like just a mess. Yeah, it's not an easy one. Just a mess. Was this clean like to cut the quesadillas with or should I get something else with the quesadillas? It's clean, just the vegetables. Yeah, I don't know if the, no no no, I didn't know if the chicken, the raw chicken. No, no, that I washed. Long time ago. Okay. The board and the knife. Do you want to take this? I have it with some crunches. Oh. <laughs> okay. Are you excited for tomorrow? Are you excited to carry us through the room and gymnastics? I think it's going to have to be all you. To climb <laughs> the room and gymnastics. I just want to try it, but now I'm thinking, like, oh, I have no upper body strength. What am I thinking? But I think there's ways to kind of tie yourself that it holds you. You know what I mean? Like, there's but you have to get up there somehow. Right, but but as you get up, it's like rope. Like you, you, it goes around your leg. Let's say so. You get a little bit up, and you hold it. You get a little bit. I don't think I can even like pull myself up once. Well, maybe it'll be good in juggling. I don't know if it's a whole circus. It's like a circus school, but I don't think we get all of it. I think we just signed up for ribbon gymnastics or whatever. And I'm, I don't know what we signed up for. Yeah, it's like going back to Burning Man. I. That's <laughs> what they do there. <laughs> the circus. Hey, really? Some people. Wow, okay. I wouldn't go to Burning Man. We should create our own this year. When does it normally take place? Last week of August. Like last weekend of August, first week of September. Should we create our own Burning Man? Yeah, burning water. <laughs> drowning the man. Oh my god, drowning? I mean, they're burning a man. Do you, uh, do you need something to put it in? No, I have my plate right here. And then we're gonna put the vegetables in. We're gonna throw those in here. It smells so freaking good. I always love like sizzling to do this coming out. Mmm, that's pretty good. You think you're good? Should we do the vegetables now? Yeah, definitely. Because when they cut small, they cook fast. Right. Alright, so now we take this and put this over here. Mmm. Oh, that smells so good. This chicken is literally the best. This is I have this on my main channel, you guys want to know like the seasoning. I'm gonna keep some of that oil in there because there's a lot of oil to be in there. So push this over and now we're gonna dump in the veggies for a couple minutes. Me just a chef over here. It's pretty. 
It is so pretty. It smells so good, too. All right, so now we're gonna put the lid on for a couple minutes. And while that happens, we're gonna prepare the quesadillas. So, do you wanna dictate how much cheese you want on yours or you want me to do it? Sure. Okay. Let me get the paper towel. Wipe this down. Alright, so this is yours. Did you say you want to or you want me to? You're gonna do it. You can do it. You know, like, you know how much cheese you want. Yes. Do you like a little or a lot? These are, we're gonna fold them, right? Mm hmm. So you'd like put it on half. Are you sure you want me to do it? Let me look. Okay. Yeah, the same way. Okay. <laughs> Usually I do do the cheese portion of our quesadillas, but. Since we are together in the kitchen. Let me fold it over. More? Tiny. Tiny. We're on the edges or the middle? Um, yeah, that's good. More? Okay. Are you that's sure? Good. Yeah. Put a bit more on mine. All right. I'm going to warm up these because we're going to make a little burrito for me. Mm. 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 Mm.
kind of a combination. I would always order fajitas. It's kind of like well, it's a combination of the two. Technically fajitas, because that's what right. I'm gonna do now. But then like, when you have the cheese, it's the quesadilla. It's like, that's all I order at um at Mexican restaurants too, or Spanish restaurants. I just order quesadillas or fajitas always. No shame in it. All right, so now we are going to let the oil put under here, but because it's pretty ready to go, we're gonna make our little quesadillas now. So this is a little fun little project. So now I take it here and we put it in the middle. I'll put it here. And so I start with the vegetables first. So they're pretty hot because they just came out. So I'm just gonna. And we do eat these. Obviously we're gonna make a little bowl for Moses and a little burrito for me. So we're gonna leave some extra. Here. This smells so good. Yeah, I'm surprised you like the quesadillas. Because I know I like you weren't flour. like. Like flour tortillas. Oh. But like, you don't really like Mexican food that much. So that's why I didn't think you would like. But I guess it's not really. It's just cheese and peppers and chicken. It's the spices. But if you said they have a lot in like Israel, it's kind of like Middle Eastern flavors. Okay. You want more vegetables on yours or is that good? That's good. I can want more. More chicken. Okay. We got lots of chicken this time. We always want to make more chicken because we both like the chicken. I like it in the burrito. He likes it in his little bowl. Okay. What was this, two chicken breasts? I think it's one. Oh, just one? Yeah, because it's like half of what we got. Then we got two. Oh, because, oh, they're thinly sliced though, right? Yeah, this is one. Okay. Drink more on yours or, oh, we'll put more. We got more, we got lots. Yeah, a little bit more in the middle. In the middle, okay. You want to take that one. <laughs> I like them chunky. Oh. <laughs> 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 I want Moses to do this no. TikTok and he refuses to. No. More? No, that's perfect. Okay, because we'll make a little bowl then too. Okay, so then we smash this down. There's a TikTok and I don't even know. Oh, it's like, I like them chunky. It's like, hello, Mojo. And it's like, from what is it? it's really funny. It's like when there's like a thicker girl sitting on a pony. <laughs> okay, so then we put them over here. And we like these crispy and well done, and the oil makes them super crispy. So we just go ahead and put the, oh, I did burn myself a little, but I'm good. That's all good, all right. So we're gonna let those sit, and then while that happens, we'll do a little, I'm gonna have a little burrito. Moses, you want this in your bowl? Yeah, make yours first. I don't want that much in mine, I'll just put a little bit. And then we'll put the remainder in yours. All right, you want the rest of this in your bowl? Sure. Okay. Oh no. Get all the juices. Eat it while it's hot, because I know you don't like the things when they get cold. Mm -hmm. Give it a little snack we have. You don't want more on yours? No. I have a quesadilla. Those will set for a couple minutes back there. Yum. Mm. Is it good? It's so good. Mm. Can you come over here? Hold it up a little. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh my god. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Honestly, the burrito is good just by itself too. I know, I forgot to do that part. <laughs> Yum. Okay, and hold the bottom. Like, mm -hmm. keep that intact. Yeah, thank you. Mmm. <laughs> Dang, we make really good food. <laughs> I'm good. Mm. <laughs> thank you. This is by far one of my favorite things I make. 
Why do we think we make it so good? Mm-hmm. We were just saying how, like, one thing about us is all our food is good. <laughs> we eat good. If we go out to a restaurant, it's good. If we make it at home, it's good. Mine can eat another minute. Yeah. Oh. Squeeze it. Squeeze it, baby. Mm. We don't compromise when it comes to food. Mm-mm. That's why I work out every day, because I just want to be able to still enjoy food. <laughs> like, tomorrow, we'll eat clean, because I have something Thursday. But then, like, Thursday, I'll be dressed up, so maybe we'll go get, like, pasta or something. You should try that place in Beverly Hills. I know, with the cheese bowl. We can have it reservation there. Mm. It's so good hot. There's like no, I mean, just chicken and vegetables, it's really healthy. Well, I mean, you have tortilla with mine, but. Just more. Mm -hmm. I really didn't eat much today. You didn't either, so. So good. Did you see the comments on us just sitting on the chair? They're like, I love how they didn't even acknowledge we're there for the whole 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, we usually don't. No! Mm. You're filming it for them. But talking to you. Oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I love that chair. Mm hmm. Oh, it's my work in the couch. So tomorrow we get a comfy couch vlog. <laughs> a big crane <laughs> to lift the couch into the house. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's kind of crazy. Like I've never made a sofa that's that big. I'm so excited to see it in our house. It's down in our garage right now. Beach plum. This is such a good flavor. It doesn't sound good at all, but it's so good. Most were gone for like half the day today and I was like so beside myself. <laughs> I'm like texting and calling, you we weren't answering your phone. I was like, oh my God, where are you? I had to put myself to sleep. Okay, take a nap. <laughs> Cause I was so beside myself. I was having like a mini crisis. But sleeping is my, my disengagement. If I sleep, I always wake up with a different mindset. Like I'm always like, okay, it's not a big deal. Chill. <laughs> but like when I'm going through a crisis and you're not around, no, but it wasn't because I wasn't here. Just I left and then something happened. Yeah. Oh, right, 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 yeah. But you were really good. I mean, you just yeah. texted me. <laughs> you make it sound more like... You just texted me. Oh, then I was like... I was, I, was, I was in the gas station. Yeah. So I didn't hear the text. And then I saw your phone go. Oh, you were in the gas station? Yeah, I was at that moment. Yeah. Like when you lift it, I'll shift it over so you can just shift it. You're gonna Always. shift it over? Let me, let me flip that. Okay. <laughs> I'll be the camera guy for you this time. Was the expert flipper? Not an expert, but it's just. It's like you're just smarter. I'm just gonna move them. Like, I don't uh, understand that. Because of the circle, you just gotta. gotta oh, see, it was pretty bad. I like it a lot. Okay. So now this one's yours. It doesn't matter, but you like one with more chicken. So that one's yours now? Yeah, this one was mine, I think, here. Okay, whatever one, I don't care. All right, so we'll probably end here because we had our, our little snack with you guys. So we're going to go watch Girls Next Door with our quesadilla. I got to go queue it up. But thanks for cooking dinner with us. It was so good. It was so good. I'm so excited to eat the quesadillas. We're going to cut them, of course. Love you guys so much. Thanks for subscribing to this channel. This channel is getting almost as much views as my main channel. So I appreciate you. I love you. And we'll see you in the next video. Look out for the room gymnastics and the giant couch. <laughs> so exciting. Next time on Trisha's <laughs> Life. Bye.